Fiend. So they switch it up. Hey, as you said, it's a bit even. I feel like a boom ID can keep the pressure up. Exactly what he wanted. But bot lane. Out of boom ID, aren't gonna be too happy looking at that. Expected is having a pretty good time on the pod. Do I say that? Chuan moves forward, gets disarmed with Decrepify. Makoto gonna play around with, with the Nether Pass. Now the rotation as well. But I'm gonna stand it and will find the kill. Kill Q comes and tries to clean him up and does do so. Top back to the Freckles, which is good. Yeah, you can't break back to my feet. I quit talking it's not very sticky. You're sad, Mike. Ends up losing it, of course. Meanwhile, mid lane, the Chuan is going to be in trouble. Guess Cute is there. Chuan holding his ground. A full charge is available now. The block is there. Chuan will find it, but will end up losing his own line. Now, he should be the secondary, and he will be. The solo up against him, so Ohio should be able to catch up himself on that farm. Bot, playing Yamate, going to find himself in trouble as well on the concrete. Should end up falling here. Two FBs again. This is the last lane solo, we can put his gap up a bit more, um, should be able to open the lane tank and do a lot more than 15 minutes ago. Nice babe. Place coming out from the side of Boom ID. They drag in Young Tay and Scam definitely going to have to be very careful. Has had a decent time so far. The roll in will not connect, though Joe Cam will get the slow one. And Scam with that gaze. They will be able to hold him in place and he will for them to back off the now they will engage. Yamate X Torrent is there. Fun as well, but it's FBD on that timber. He's a really hard thing to go for with just right clicks. Still got about half takes to be done. Cross is taking all low. Double in swap is there and now the ult comes out. He does end up dropping a now jump cam in there with the chain frost. Where's the bouncers? It's very oh. unlucky, but they will finally end up getting Yamate. So he's died four times, Wang. FBZ has died four times. And it doesn't seem like it's a factor at all. No. Seems like he's been free farming the whole time, honestly. Chuan being chased down gets slowed up. He's been stunned as well, although he will walk away. Jokan could be in trouble. The boat will come in. It does actually end up connecting onto a few heroes. It won't really matter too much because Boom seem unaffected by this and they'll continue moving forward. FBZ can't find anybody. It doesn't look like it, although they do ping out Ohio and FBZ is on the chase. Ohio making a run for it. But how fast can this man run? FBZ. Top tower. Does get there, surely Ohio stuns him up, he is in front of him and he will not make an FBZ! <laughs> Attack, looks like they want to make a push at that top lane. They are completely surrounded however, and Yamate wants to go for the TP but does get Yule Star. Looking for Yule to the back of the map for the game. Though I say that they have smoked up and they will run past, they break the smoke as well. Now they do, but the red group is already there. Now they run in. 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 Low attack, FBZ all alone, he's gonna try and find this by himself, in fact, Mikoto comes back in, the end back on FBZ, dragging him back to the pit, they will take him out, and that's board gauge. FBZ actually going back in, but there's five heroes around us right now, they will be sold by another Ohio, doesn't really want to go to the team fighter, but they are forcing to stick around, blind out, pick it up, be around, they will go up there, FBZ, there is the red win, and FBZ is down, though Fermin is a massive problem on that life sealer, but now he's for it as well. Now they are going to continue rolling in, Joe Cam goes after Skim, he keeps the magnetize going as well, so they have roots up. The Pan Frost is there, but it will only go on to one. Meanwhile, Skim, getting started with that BKB, Dakota is putting that game away from the back line, although they will lose Joe Cam as well on the side of Boom ID. The game is there to hold down Skim, he has the battle plans and will get started on Kesku, though that Frost Shield making it really hard to actually hit anything, and Skim looks like he will end up going down to Makoto early in. Going. Rage was there, Ohio is going to be the target. He basically heals up all his HP now, Fabian, and he takes down an Ohio as well. They are getting rather close. Yamate drops the ward but gets caught out immediately. Skem continues to farm the Ancients. They will take him. We'll back off the safety again. 
Skim actually walks past the Skim, what are you doing? He's baiting them in. BKB, Frost Shield was there. Skim has the Battle Tramps available, the Chain Frost. Who bounced around and does absolutely nothing. Soulbind is there as well. Joe Cam jumps in after Chuan. Coming out, the boat does miss everything. Joe Cam still alright throughout all this, although they are making the chase now. And it looks like Lotak will be able to find something surely. Although FBZ in those front lines making sure they can't kill off anybody. And now they will chase Keskew. Although a nice kick back onto Yamate. He ends up dying. Scam is very, very low and he ends up going down as well. And it looks like Joe Cam gonna make the final chase out onto the Grimstroke and he will end up going down Raven could not survive that there will be buybacks coming out from the side of Lotak but they're losing to Dakota he's in the thousand apparently he's the fucking kill they will get Joe Camp but the GG call's already been made and look at those tips coming out for Skip do my thing we have I mean they hey what Okay, um, this for scam to farm up. Oh, we'll find out, Mike. Do we see a ball like that, however? There will be a bit of an engagement, Ohio. Find himself in trouble and will end up going down to the Kobe. Joe Cam as well, falling quite low, but he'll turn around with the chip. And with that, Raven should end up losing his own life. And Furbian ends up getting him. Preparing for some beach every time. He needs to shoot some up to the spam. To be called. Oh my, no hot. Top tower is under attack. BZ, I'll get spotted out by Raven. That all time stop. Will not connect a nice dodge from FBZ. He should be able to just walk his way out of there safely. In fact, he will go for the TV play. One is there. He does get the lift in time. That's a nice pickup coming out. Start bear fruit, really. Raven. That's cute. So Keskude actually finds him, and then with no camp there as well, he should be a kill. Although the stomp, they will not go through or kill it. They will find the kill and get Keskude to camp. The wall was already dropped as well, so they need to be in front of that after. They will get started on the static link with FBZ. Meanwhile, though, Makoda gets started on China and takes immediately, and now Ohio will be the target on the razor. Is he continuing the chase to stop? Will do a pretty nice job to stop the back line. FBZ actually going too far, but apparently not. They will end up fighting Ohio, and they will continue the chase with the Stormhammer off the scam. Shackles will be there as well. Boom ID. Although a nice back comes down, they will be able to find the cam regardless, and now they go for more. Scam morphs into the spam. Once you get that storm hammer on, where did he can and it's at the stop, we'll lock it up. And it as well, soak up, up and rush in. So drops are there on Ohio, it doesn't work as really matter. They even wards just in case. And no Ohio ends up playing with those wards deep. They would not to play. They do have the search storm as well. A nice wall being placed. It won't do too much for his sake, but it looks like he will be able to find his way out eventually. Furbian may turn around, but he thinks that that static flick up. They will manage to get Raven on that Earth Spirit. Excuse me. As well as his odds, it looks like. But no, he will be able to walk his way out, but the walls certainly aren't very safe. Ohio, though, gets slipped in, wants to try and go for something here. The Furbian comes in and it's a full out good plan from the Stone Potak. The Radiance is all top on Furbian right now. They do manage to take the uh, the bounty rune. Lock up the corner and tell it because your whole team again actually man fighting with FBZ. Just having him disappear is much, much less ideal. Now the Furbian. He's going in by himself, Ohio just saps all his damage, why do you even turn around for him? You're dealing no damage, you're probably healing him up right now, although the back line, again, Boom ID getting caught out, and Knight's not coming up, but it's not going to be quite enough, and Keskude goes down as well as Joke Cam. Furbian. What? 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 How? Furbian. That's not out a Rubid, but... Rather just go for the T2 mid tower, of course. But the Lion will punch in there. It was there, it was stolen. Lion Rufik, and now they're trying to burn Furby and down. Ohio, though, has caught himself with 
Rocking an arc weapon in the back wall comes out as well. Nice wall splitter, but it doesn't really do too much damage. And Ohio, he'll start moving forward with that boss, but trying to get somebody. The NPZ is the time. He has no mana left to serve, but he just gets it with the hex again. Comes out from Schwan. NPZ will end up going down to Ohio. They do end up looting their Oracle, but he no cares about that. They found a fix as well. Can feel the damage in the Kodo. Would have gone down to the morning and now Burnian, however, he finds Ohio and he finds what? him on that morphling. Surely they do, because they are running that way. Oh, behind up onto the line speed up. And he does take all the damage from Burby and in fact even more than that. A nice look at the back line as well, but Skem, nice earth as well. Can they do the damage however? Ken Skewed, he will be the one to go down first, although they find Joke as well. The shackles in there onto Skem, the ball's from that as well. And well, there's a lot of fun that's coming up to my knee right now. Ohio will get put out. Tron also ends up being taken down. Skem, he's just trying to make a run for it. The rest of the ID making the change. Joe Cam, he gets the super, he wants that hex and he does find it. Has the shackle available as well. Can that deal the damage, however? He does not have mana for the four players. In fact, no, he does now, but he's still going to end up going down by the books. And with that, oh, how are you got the card in Cam? You're definitely going to be able to take the towers too. Oh, Cam Yamate get a ball. With that, he's going to go to the first half of the game, but I but he may just away for that. Doesn't have my back available on a boom ID. Apply that pressure around the Roche pit. We have this smoke coming out from Boom, and in fact, who they down on there? It's 30 It's a lot of death coming up for low attack. This could be going down. Can't play softies. Ohio, he can't afford to die right now. He looks like he has no choice in this. He does the fight down, and it's a dieback for him. Skim, try. Nice deal up, and he will find Chuan surely. The Yules will be there, but it won't be enough. He does get taken down. T4s are still open for the tech taking. There's currently next chasing each other. Scam. Try and man fight this. He's actually doing a lot of damage to Burby who raises up. Wants to hit someone to come here. Anybody running now. In fact, he finds Chuan. Finds Scam as well. He got himself back up throughout all the Scam is just trying to find throughout all this madness. He actually gets the Agi more. Don't know if that's going to help a call. He does end up going down. That's a GG call coming in as well. John, was that the second time that happened? Did I just, did I just, am I blind? Really? Uh, no, I, I think that was the thing I'm calling. Yeah, I, I, I think it's very hard to show the strength where it's your open up. But, but a really unfortunate trade for low attack. That's